This course starts off with a discussion of what are the major landmarks in the study of hallucinogens and culture. And I'm sure some of you can come up with your own. My favorite is the miracle at Marsh Chapel, the Good Friday experiment conducted in 1962 by Walter Pankey at Marsh Chapel, Chapel at Boston University. This study created an illuminated synthesis between religion and science, and it definitively proved that synthetic psilocybin could create and generate an authentic mystical experience. What happened, it was a double blind experiment. They gave to 10 divinity students psilocybin. They gave to the other 10 divinity students niacin as a placebo. Nine out of the 10 students who received the psilocybin had a full-blown mystical experience. And one of them, Houston Smith, the eminent uh, scholar of religion who died recently said, this was the most powerful cosmic homecoming I have ever experienced. Uh, Walter H. Clark, a distinguished psychologist said, there are no other experiments known to me in the history of the scientific study of religion better designed or clearer in their conclusions than this one. 25 years later, Rick Doblin, the founder of MAPS, did a follow-up study. 25 years later, he found seven out of the nine uh, divinity students who experienced the psilocybin. And he found that for all of them, they considered this to be one of the most important and enduring experiences in their life. We believe we are, our sense, my sense, is that this is my favorite landmark study because it creates an important significant thread in the tapestry of the history of psychedelics, uniting the ancient past with the present psychedelic renaissance.